Hey guys, it's Horizon. And Blizz. Walk the preview for the Patriots at Seahawks. Um, how they're even going to play this game, I have no idea. And air quality is horrible in Seattle. But whatever. Um, injury report. In fact, I think the Mariners aren't playing. I think they are. They. I know they had one game like delayed. When? I think last week. Well, that's last week. You know, I don't know. That's what I heard about. So I don't know. Whatever. They're there for a reason, so. Yeah, I guess. I'm assuming they wouldn't travel if the conditions weren't. They're not good. They're still playing, so. As far as I know, they are, yeah. I mean, they probably shouldn't be. Considering all the fires and the air quality, but whatever. Um, or they should have moved it to a different stadium, frankly. Well, so should have all the other West Coast teams, but they're all still playing. I know, they shouldn't be. They should be at different stadiums right now. Um, anyway, injury report, Adam Butler's questionable with the shoulder. Um, Brandon Copeland with his knee is questionable. Edelman, of course, is always injured. Of course he is. His knee still questionable. I think he had it last week, too. Harry's added with a shoulder. I guess fumbling at the goal line is just too much for him. Hurts him. He gets hurt. Like yeah, he's a pain. Stomping his toe. I know. <laughs> Whatever. I imagine Harry will still play. They probably I think all will. will still play. Slater with a knee. Uh, questionable. And linebacker Josh Uch is already out with his ankle. He's one of their draft picks that still hasn't yeah, played. Yeah, I know. Of course he hasn't. Hopefully Dalton Keene will play this week. I'd like to see if he's, you know, remotely decent. Uh, where is where's Seattle's injury list? You just passed it. I know. Uh, really, did I? Where? Keep going. Right there. Ah, oh, there it is. <laughs> All right, here we go. Um, Seattle. Philip Dorsett is questionable. He didn't actually participate in Friday's practice, so he probably won't play. I mean, I mean, who cares? It's Philip Dorsett. Ah, <laughs> uh, good old Philip. Uh, defensive end Rasheem Green, doubtful with the neck. Tackle Cedric Ogbuhe. I, 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 I don't know how you pronounce, know how to pronounce that one. Doubtful. And Dwayne, Bro, Dwayne, Dwayne Brown, tackle. What is resting veteran? Ah, uh, he had a rest day for a veteran. Some oh. veterans get rest days. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just, that's unknown, which is funny. Yeah. He's obviously going to play. It's just a rest day. I've never seen it like that. And they have. They legally have to point. Have to have to report if somebody doesn't show up to practice, even if it's for yeah. a rest day or whatever. Tight end Will Disley with his Achilles. For some reason, the, his status is unknown. I don't know why. That's very strange. Uh, he was limited for some practice. That's odd, but whatever. Anyway, so this game is uh, going to be rough <laughs> at Seattle. Um, when was the last time they played there? Uh, four, or five, lost. four or five years ago? I don't know. They've, 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 they've lost the last two matchups in the regular season. They beat them in the Super Bowl, obviously, so who cares? Yeah. But the last time they played them in the regular season, they lost to them at home. They did, yes, unfortunately. A year or two ago. Um, Seattle's, Seattle's a very good team. Um, hopefully, so the Patriots need to contain Wilson, <laughs> uh, which hopefully they can do better with having a mobile quarterback of their own to actually practice against now. Right. Um, that's step one. Step two is limit the deep ass that Wilson loves. Yep. <laughs> that's step two. And defensively, or offensively, um, play action passing because Seattle is notoriously bad at defending it. They were one of the worst last year. I think they, they were like the third worst in the league. Does Cam do that a lot? Yeah. Of course he does. <laughs> that's one of the things he does the best, mm -hmm. so. I'm sure they'll be. So, a lot of people are saying that if they can beat Seattle, they'll be a good AFC contender late, down the road, but they still have a couple of really hard... I don't know hard, if they can beat Seattle. I don't know. If they can pull out a win, it would be awesome, but they still have uh, some really hard teams it's to play. It's a hard schedule. Yeah. So, um, I mean, Seattle runs a cover three. They don't run that man scheme that, that Miami does, so there won't be as many read option runs or anything like that. It's a primetime game, but it's going to be weird because it'll be 5.30 on the West Coast when we're watching at 8.30 on the East Coast. So it's still going to be like daylight there, which is bizarre. But... Oh, I know. <clears throat> but they'll probably, you know, if Edelman's able to play, he'll have a lot of soft zone he can exploit. So that'll be good. Yeah, if they squeak out a win, it would be great. But um, I'm kind of... I don't think they're going to win this game. I'm doubtful, yeah. I, I, I believe Seattle will 
probably win this game, unfortunately. It'll be close. I think the Patriots are better than people give them credit for uh, this year, but I think they're probably going to lose like 24-21 or something. Some close score, probably. But I'll be pleasantly surprised if they win. Yeah, it would be nice. It would be nice to see that. All right, this is Ryzen. We'll and Liz. do the recap later. And it probably won't be up until Monday afternoon. Clearly not. Because it'll be very, very late tonight when we actually record it, so. Yeah. Whatever. All right, good night.